Naturally, anybody who's seen uh, the uh, TikTok videos about Victor Seaman that were posted on uh, Napoli's uh, official club TikTok account, um, they must all be wondering, what were they thinking? And uh, clearly, when you go out and you post such uh, offensive videos, such um, certainly, if not racist, uh, certainly racially insensitive um, material about a guy who is your most beloved player, arguably your, your best player since, uh, since the days of Juan Diego Armando Maradona. Um, and you do this at such a sensitive time, uh, as well. Let's not forget yesterday when, when that story went, uh, viral, that was the day that the Napoli president, Aurelio de, Le, de Laurentiis, uh, had to answer legal charges, uh, from a Rome court, uh, about false accounting in the transfer of Victor Osimen from Lille to Napoli. Um, it seems entirely insensitive. Uh, it also seems entirely illogical from from Napoli's perspective. This came also after uh, after Nap after he had met with Coach Rudy Garcia, where where he had apologized for his actions at the weekend when uh, when he sort of uh, very visually um, questioned his decision to make a substitution rather than go with uh, with the two strikers. Uh, it, it seems like a, like an act of wanton self harm by Napoli and an act of self destruction. Uh, this also, by the way, comes at a time when um, he's involved in, in in a contract renegotiation as well. Uh, his agent, uh, Antonio Calenda, has come out very strongly saying that, you know, they're molding legal action. Um, I Personally, I think that if they do not get an apology or an explanation, uh, legal action at a minimum isn't just, uh, he's not just entitled to it, it's almost required. Um, in terms of what Napoli were thinking, <laughs> which is what mystified me here, uh, the people familiar with the club suggest that, you know, this was done by a social media manager and that those, uh, TikToks are essentially their, their takes on very popular TikToks. The I'm a coconut one, the other one with a squeaky voice. Um, I'm not on TikTok because I'm clearly too old, but it, they were supposed to be hilarious takes on, uh, popular TikTok memes or, or, or trends as they call them. Uh, whatever it is, it was inappropriate, it was offensive, Victor Seaman deserves better.